and these flies is Mr. Golden Dollars. Thank you. This may be a little bit depressing to some of you, but in the last class, the anticipated revenue was $670 million. Now, we voted that tax down. Now, this is four years later. The projected revenue is $543 million. That's $127 million less because we're, the economy is not doing what it was forecasted to do at the last plus. If you had had programs at the last plus, the ones in the last year wouldn't have got delivered. We've got three splots in this county now. 1% sales taxes. Each one of those takes $20 million a year out of the private enterprise and puts it in the public coffers. This would be the force plus. That'd be $80 million a year coming out of the county and going somewhere else. Now, I took economics in college in my sophomore year, one class, but here's something I learned about free enterprise economics. When you go to a store and you buy something and you hand that guy your money and he hands you the goods, if the goods are sound and the check don't bounce, there is no further obligation past that point. When I go to raise mill pond and eat catfish, I don't come home and wonder what they owe me for me going up there and eat. And so there is no debt. If there was a debt due, we'd be getting lawsuits over. If there was, if we owe the counties around us for shopping here, what do we owe Madison County? and Hamilton County in Florida. They got more people down there that come up here and shop than any place in their county. We don't owe them anything. We have provided, when that merchant builds the building, pays the rent, puts the goods in stock, and sells them, he has done me a favor. I drive up to Adel. I call it the Adel gift shop. He's got a thousand guns in inventory. <laughs> I threw all that much in, you know, walking through there looking at his guns. But that's how he gets me to come up there. This tax, one of the things they did is the legislature said that 30% of the tax that's raised under any SPLOS tax Time's up. 30% <laughs> has to go to the state. We're giving another 28% away, $54 million, $56 million to other counties. That's not good business. You would never sign a contract like that in business. Thank you.